first day properly riding in Vietnam and um, I'm having to fight through a lot of construction. It's not like in the UK, if you have construction going on, they close the road and send you some other way. You still have to go on it, so if need be, you have to ride on fresh tarmac, which isn't doing my wheels any good because it's all kind of gunging up inside the fenders. The good thing about all this construction is the road they're building is really nice to ride on. I don't know if it's um, uh, a Chinese built road or what, but look at this. This, is, <laughs> this stuff's all wet and I'm on, I'm in my lane. And if a truck comes towards me, I have to jump onto that wet stuff. Because um, those, those trucks, they don't stop for anything. Around every bend, they just beat their horn and that's basically, I'm coming through, get out of the way. So when I say they make you ride straight through the construction, look at this, this is the bit I've come along to rejoin the main carriageway. You're literally driving through the, through the roadworks. This is just, this is madness. <laughs> oh. First impressions of Vietnam. People aren't as friendly here. I think they're just more used to seeing people from different places. And one thing I can say is when all this construction is done, the road between Laos and Vietnam will be like crossing from night to day coming from Laos into Vietnam because this road will be really good when it's done. This kid here supports Manchester United. <laughs> He's really shy. <laughs> so this is just a shop I've stopped at to get some water and cakes. Somebody take me back to Lao. <laughs> oh man. about the 16th time I've stopped to clean out the fenders and the gearing of all the muck and the mud that they're building this road out of. When it gets clogged up it's um, it's just a nightmare because um, the wheels just don't roll and then you it just gets harder and harder and harder as you climb up the hills and then you get to the downhill and then you have to pedal downhill as well and it's like what because <laughs> it's the fresh tar asphalt whatever that they use to lay on the road what I can't let it do is um, kind of bond to the tire or set in there um, because that real will really be hard to get <laughs> So after 60 kilometers of these roadworks, I think I'm through and um, got a bit of downhill here and it's smooth and um, it's a very welcome sight. In terms of the scenery here in Vietnam, I don't really know what to say. It's, it's pretty mountainous and it's pretty nice, but coming from Laos, um, yeah, it's failing to impress me really, but it's been a nice day, a hard day, but a nice day so far. And um, I think I'm about 20 kilometers from the, um, the town where I think there's a guest house. And so I'm gonna just head down and pedal to that and try and get there before sundown. Mm -hmm.